as someone who comes on here and speaks on issues concerning church, I think it would be self-centered of me to not share with you a great enricher of my basic understanding. There is a book called When Narcissism Comes to Church, Healing Your Community from Emotional and Spiritual Abuse. It looks like this. Right, is that, did that get an interview? It was written by Chuck D. Grote and introduces multiple faces of narcissism which unfortunately manifest in today's church. Does it look like I'm being sponsored? No, I'm telling you this because, well, I want you to have that knowledge too, if you care. One point of persuasion would be, just think about all the damaging effects narcissism can have within a church and its members. How it may divide and cause strife and enmity and resentment. If you care about your community and would like some extra discernment, I would say that this material could help kickstart that process. I'll show it again. Get it before your enemies. They'll try and study it for weaknesses. Just as they do with the Bible, they may pick out the parts that convenience them. They may twist the context or twist the underlying message. Control freaks really be moving crazy, so move smart and with discretion. I'll share with you a Bible verse, which I'm not even sure relates to this topic, but the Holy Spirit brought it to my memory. A good man out of the good treasure of his heart bringeth forth that which is good. And an evil man out of the evil treasure of his heart bringeth forth that which is evil. For of the abundance of his heart his mouth speaketh. Don't forget that Jesus loves you, and I love you too. Bye.